Hey guys, it's me, KC, and welcome to the second episode tie in in season 27. Now, unfortunately, the original video got corrupted, but I can tell you exactly how it starts off. Marge wants to stop at the Quickie Mart to pick up some things. Homer, being fat and lazy, doesn't want to, but they see a big crowd at the Quickie Mart, and basically, Homer loves being first in line, and that's pretty much where we end off. Stop this trampling! Who knew people would physically attack each other to buy plastic jack-o'-lanterns and glittery fake eyelashes? I love the NAC of America. Yeah. Yeah. Abu, this line is too long. Some people gave up and went home before they were properly gouged. This is too much work for one man. I know, but this country does not allow child labor. Even if you have eight of them. True, but you can still hire sullen teenagers. Oh goody. Interview up. Hold on a second. They've worked in the show before, the Octoblets. Haven't they? I'm sure they have. Well, I mean, maybe I'm just losing it. I don't know now, but. Anyways, Apu's going to interview teenagers for four hours. So, technically a 12 hour quest. Alrighty, so I'm actually going to speed up the remaining couple of quests. Normally I don't do stuff like this, but I want to show you the building. I might as well, I'm this far into it, right? And with the daily challenges, the 20 donuts coming up, I will be able to make a profit in the end. Anyway, technically, if you think about it that way. So we'll speed up this quest. There we go. This will be the second one, I think. Okay. And we've got to do the final one. Right. Oh crap, I did the wrong one. Oh crap, I did the wrong one. Did it count? Did it cancel it? What happened? Oh damn it. I actually did a marker price one. Oh well. Oh well. So that's actually wasting two donuts. Now before we start the interview, I have to ask, how familiar are you with the labor laws of this country? You mean like minimum wage and stuff? What are you, some kind of lawyer? Get out! I know when I'm being set up. The squeaky teen's pretty smart for his own good, isn't he? Alright, let's continue on. Hopefully they can hire somebody else. Manjula, the teenagers in this town insist on being paid the same as an actual person. Oh, the nerve of them. Maybe I should start paying a living wage for a dependable quality employee. I don't think Manjula likes that. Just kidding. Oh, you scared me. I thought we were having a stroke, or you were having a stroke. I'll hire some sketchy transients for next to nothing. Oh, by the way, the Space Mutant there you can see there, he's actually available as the premium for this episode time, if you don't have him. Comes with a driver. So, sketchy transient, two donuts. I clicked the right one this time, that's great. Apu, the scuzzy weirdos you hired are living in the alley behind the Quickie Mart. Perfect. They won't be late and they'll eat the rats. Eat the rats? That's kind of weird. I mean, there's a brain that we just got. They could eat that. Apu, where's your clingiest brand of fake cobweb? Everweb. It can never be completely taken down. You'll be picking fake cobwebs out of your hedge for years to come. I want to make sure I have enough. Do you have a hundred packages? I can order you a hundred packages. I need a hundred packages of a bunch of things. As Springfielders always say, when it comes to Halloween, more is more. Oh, when did they say that? Are my eyes dollar signs? I feel like my eyes just turned into dollar signs. Bulk from China. Got an eight hour quest. Let's continue with that. Uh, where's it going? Oh, it's going to the quickie mart. Okay, I got confused. Let us speed this up. Four donuts now. I don't know how many donuts that is. Fourteen? Apu, what are these giant boxes doing in the children's bedroom? 
and where are the children? I needed this darkroom. I moved the octopus to the kitchen. It will build character to learn to live together in the space under the table. Apu, your Halloween side business has outgrown the Quickie Mart. The recliner barn went out of business. You can rent that space for a month and open up a pop-up Halloween store. What a brilliant idea! But it will be a lot of work running two stores. You could watch your tuplets and I can run the two stores. It will be a nice break for me. No, no, I'll do it. My stores need their daddy. Wow, it must be hell raising eight kids, I guess, at once. Here we go. 13,500. We're gonna just pluck this down now. How many donuts have I spent? I said 14, but I think it might have been 10. Maybe. Technically, it should have been 8, I think. Maybe. Let's speed it up. Whee! And the suspense, baby! The suspense. Fancy! I like that. So, before we do the quest, which is this, let's click it. Let's see what it sounds like. Ooh, I like that. I really like that. It's very Halloween-y. I, I meant to click it again. I want it here again. Patching fake spider. That's awesome. Alright, let's see what this animation is going to look like for this building. Ooh. Got the light. We got the sign lighting up. That's pretty Halloween-y. Kind of creepy, I guess. And from what I understand, I think this is a permanent eight-hour quest as well with the poo. So you can always use it that I know of, but I could be wrong. I just looked that up and that's what people had said, so we'll see for sure if that's correct, I guess, after the event ends. Anyways, guys, that is going to wrap it up for now. So if you guys enjoyed this video and would really love to show your support, hit that thumbs up button. That would be super duper awesome. Amazing. Thanks for watching. My name is Casey and I will see you on the next episode time in the future. Bye-bye, guys.